ericmothersmother.com. Let's take a look at some of the cannabis stocks that have been on fire over the last couple of weeks and months. We can see here CGC has had an explosive move over the last couple of weeks. Take a look at C-O-R-N. C-R-O-N. Excuse me. We've seen a nice explosive move here. The best performing one, without a doubt, has been T-L-R-Y, which has had a substantial jump. And of course, this can also be seen by taking a look at the ETF that tracks that sector, the cannabis sector, which has also been on fire. All right. Now, since we've already seen a big run-up and lots of volatility, you can see here, for example, TLRY was trading at the highs here of about 125, and the next day went as low as, let's call it 97, only to close at about 109. So huge volatility. Now the question becomes what next? Of course, this is a huge, huge run up. Now we start looking for evidence of the next direction being down. And I believe if we take a look at the ETF, the MJ ETF, this is where we can start looking for short opportunities. Reason is very simple. We've seen a move today on the two hourly chart to new highs. But this is coming with the RSI declining. So that is clearly negative divergence. A sign of running out of technical strength. We can also see that it corresponds with our uniformity line. Based on this break. So we come and hit that line with uniform action. And we are rejected early this morning. We can also draw another line, which is one that we can use as a backtest line, like this, where we have the break. In fact, let me draw that line a little bit different. Same line, just want to use a thinner line so we can see clearly what's going on here. All right. Should be something like that. And what has happened here is we broke below here and this is in my opinion a warning high in other words this move here is warning you that there is preparation for the next major move lower but before that you're going to get a fake move higher ultimately the next direction in my opinion could actually be pointing down and we can see evidence of this because of backtest failure on the red line so lots of things going on here you can even draw a fourth line showing resistance. If you draw it like that. All of these lines are pointing that this is where you can position yourself short, of course, with a stop. But looks like all these cannabis related stocks are due to correct from current levels, which means you can take a look at CGC around current levels here at about just over $50. By the way, we can see here an attempt. In fact, let me go ahead and update this chart. Yeah, all right. By the way, you'll see that the two stocks or the main stocks that are moving on my watch list here, TLRY at 147, I believe around here it's a short, C-O-R-N. I believe all these stocks at current levels are suspect as they make, as you can see here, they're making fresh intraday highs, all time highs, especially for TLRY. I believe you can look for an opportunity here to short this, of course, with a stop somewhere. And let me update this one more time. So even CGC right here, to me, it looks like it is a candidate to be shorted. Take a look at C-R-O-N, doing its best to come back to test this recent level here where it broke down. I think this could be an area of logical resistance. So I would look to get out, short this instrument at current levels, 
MACDs, in my opinion. We've seen one of the MACDs already drop below zero. And take a look at the king of them all right now, TLRY. You can see here trading at all time highs, but I believe if you go to the ETF, MJ, which is carrying the weight of the entire sector, I would say this negative divergence, as we discussed, is a sign that this is running out of energy and one can look to short based on the various lines we drew connecting this top showing us there's a resistance here on the two hourly chart that was one line the other line was a back test line and of course there's one more line which is the RSI top side resistance line all of these lines are pointing in my opinion that right now this is where you can take a position which is the opposite position, anticipating that for the marijuana stocks, the next, next major trend, in my opinion, is down. And of course, you want to set a stop, because as we can see, even right now, TLRY is trading at all-time highs as we speak. But I think the next major trend is lower so one can start building a short position from current price levels. Eric Mwadith, mother, 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 m